Ta da! Look at that. It's one of those, uh, get it in a bag, pour it in the thingy mills, and yeah, that, that bit right there. There's the instructions. Pour meal into large nonstick skillet. Cover and cook cover medium high for eight minutes, stirring occasionally. Uncover, continue cooking three to four minutes, stirring frequently until sauce is thickened. Number four, check that food is cooked thoroughly. Careful, it's hot. Yeah. Generally, when you cook something, it's hot. Generally. You know, unless you're cooking ice cream, in, in which case... We need clear definitions as to what cooking is. Hold up. I'm gonna Google this shit. Cooking. I'm gonna Google cooking and look through a series of different... Different freaking... Just bring up a new little tab here. And I'll type in... Uh, let's see. Just Google the word cooking. I hope the latest PewDiePie video doesn't pop up. Uh, all images, videos, news, books, more. Um, CookingChannelTV.com Cooking gadgets. What to cook this weekend? Okay. Um, tasty on YouTube. How to make sushi on YouTube. Okay, yeah, very nice. That is not what I was looking for. Cooking shows. People also searched for. Uh, I'm not interested. Right. Cooking New York Times dot com. YouTube. Wikipedia. Okay, there we go. There's one that I might use, which I have never used Wikipedia before. Let's see what cooking on Wikipedia means. Cooking from Wikipedia, the free encyclopedia. Why would you advertise yourself as the free encyclopedia? This article is about the preparation of food. For a general outline, see outline of food preparation. Why would I want a general outline? I just want the definition of the word cooking. Cooking or cookery is cookery. <laughs> I don't know why that one makes me laugh. Makes me think of a, a cookie and uh, cooking all at the same time. Is the art, technology, science, and craft of preparing food for consumption. Okay, Wikipedia says that all that stuff, art, tech, science, and craft of preparing food for consumption. So, with that, you could say that cooking includes the cold process of making ice cream. So it doesn't mean hot necessarily, based on that one sentence alone. Cooking techniques and ingredients vary widely across the world from grilling food over an open fire to using electric stoves to baking in various types of ovens, reflecting unique environment. Okay, preparing food for consumption, and they go and jump right into listing all these types of eating the food reflecting unique environmental economic and cultural traditions and trends the ways or types of cooking also depend on the skill and type of training an individual cook has and uh, this is a spiel of Okay, yeah, the free encyclopedia. Yeah, an encyclopedia would go on and do a spliel. I'm just gonna 
search for the Merriam-Webster's International Dictionary. Um, Oh, Miriam has fucking two R's in it. Okay. Uh, enter in a T I O N A L. Dictionary Merriam Webster International Dictionary. Oh, there's the unabridged. Okay, I'll go and look for that one. Do they have an online? Definition of cook by Marion Webster. Okay. MerriamWebster.com. Okay, it's got a nice stash in there. Cook and cooking. I'm going to go with cooking. Cooking. Adjective. Definition of cooking. Suitable for used suitable for or used in cooking. Correct me if I'm wrong, but I was told that you can't use the root word within the definition. The definition of cooking. Suitable for or used in cooking. Why are you using the root word in the definition? Well, this bit right here. This bit. Definition of cooking. Suitable for or used in cooking. Correct me if I'm wrong, but you're not supposed to use the root word you're defining in the definition of the word itself. That's what I've been told. Recent, recent examples on the web. Not only does it... Okay. This just quotes from people. I was about to say idiots. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna... Okay, it is. Cook. Noun. Definition of cook. A person who prepares food for eating. Okay. A technician or industrial pro... Technical or industrial process that... Words... A technical or industrial process comparable to cooking food, also a substance so processed. What? Okay, it's also a verb, including synonyms such as cooked, cooking, and cooks. Maybe that's conjugation or instead of synonyms. Definition of cook. Intransitive verb to prepare food for eating, especially by means of heat. Aha! Sherlock, a clue! 
There we go. Cooking as a verb, transitive, definition one, to prepare food for eating, especially by means of heat. Finally. So, the Merriam-Webster's International Dictionary defines cooking as using heat to prepare food for consumption. Which leads me right back around in the circular logic to the, um, the warning on the bag saying cooked food is hot. Well, according to the Merriam-Webster's International Dictionary, that's elementary there, Watson. And yes, that was sarcasm. I was wondering why... I was wondering why this warning... Yeah, right there. Caution. It's hot. Alright, careful, it's hot. Duh! By very definition, cooking food means it's going to be hot! Dickheads. Oh, I love where that landed. Right in the box. Since I spent a good deal of minutes actually uh, looking that up, you know, just let that simmer for a bit more. <sighs> okay, I know why everyone's printing this warning, caution, food is hot, bullshit on on the uh, instructions for cooking the food. It's because that one idiot who sued McDonald's over hot coffee. Eh? That's what you call social justice warrioring. Idiot spills hot coffee on lap. Sues McDonald's because the coffee is hot. Coffee is, is 90% of all coffee is served hot. I mean, unless you get an iced mocha latte or an iced frappuccino, the coffee is going to be fucking hot. We're on to something here, everybody. It's cold, everyone's acting like a fucking idiot. It's all circle in the drain. Every last bit of it. It's all circle in the drain. So, no shit, Sherlock. When you cook food, it's fucking hot. Unless you go to France and you get that cold potato soup dipshit. Hey. Want to know how that's related to the current climate of the uh, all the social media platforms and everything? It's those same types of people who get hot coffee, spill it on themselves, and then sue the company that made the hot coffee because they weren't warned it was hot. It's the same kinds of idiots. It's the same fucking ones.
who think that y y your coffee should have a fucking LED panel on it with a fucking yellow LED display with a black background saying the word caution, food is hot. Duh. Food is fucking hot when you cook it, dipshits. So same idiots going into Reddit and Twitter and Facebook and writing articles for Kotaku and the, the, the fucking Wall Street Journal. So same fucking idiots. just the same old shit, different date. Same old shit. Couple of the new idiots. Couple of them are the same ones. Just a different date, different time. I don't know about all of you, but I'm jaded. I'm jaded from the bullshit. Of course I fucking know food is hot. I cooked it, you fucking idiot. What is it? We got fucking soccer moms who who are so distracted by their kids because they, they're too afraid to parent them because of DHR and they don't want to teach the kids to have any fucking manners, discipline, self-respect, self-control or anything. Is that the type of idiots who are getting coffee and spilling it in their laps? And then going and writing articles in Kotaku. They have no fucking idea what's going on. They're just bitching and whining. Is that what's going on? <laughs> I'm jaded from the bullshit. Because it's the same thing. It's just moved into a new place. Or new place. Haha, <laughs> very funny. It's just the same bullshit. It's just a different time. It's depressing. It, it's pushed me and polarized my psychology to the point where every time one of these news presses, releases, or some bullshit, every time someone goes off and says something that's negative, I'm like, oh god, what is this going to snowball into now? Oh my god in hell, it does not exist. What is this going to snowball into now? What are, you, what are you going to rile up? How many social justice faggots are going to rally behind you? Where is this bullshit going to lead to? Who's going to get caught in the crossfire this time? It's, it's all the same bullshit. It doesn't fucking stop. And what is, what is me going on this spiel a, a pill to? <laughs> that newest bit from Ian Sher, Who wrote a fucking hit piece. Uh, yeah. You think, Ian, and the rest of you fucking idiots, that when the Wall Street Journal attacked pewds and, and that didn't go through so well for them that you'd stop the bullshit but no, you fucking didn't you doubled down on it again and again and again well instead of attacking me the individual gamer and uh, people like me who have a YouTube channel or people like uh, Upper Echelon Games or Clean Prince Gaming or Angry Joe or Jim Sterling who you know, shows you the bullshit going on and they tell you honestly, here's what's good, here's what's bad why the fuck does the bad outweigh the good? Yeah, instead of attacking people like that maybe you should attack the fucking bitches in the, the fucking corporate executive world who are treating the fucking game developers like shit and then that shit gets dumped on people like me. Eh? That's a good idea, isn't it? Clean up the real shit. Stop being such a fucking idiot. That's all I've got to say for now. Till next time, everyone. Bye.